Hey, good Monday morning, everyone. I hope you had a great weekend. We are waking up this morning with temperatures above average 32 right now under a mostly cloudy sky. Wind not much of an issue this morning from the southeast, only at about five miles per hour. So you can see where the clouds are. Algona reporting a mostly cloudy sky up towards Fort Dodge, even some patchy fog out there. Waterloo, one of the coldest spots, even decor right now at seven degrees, and then we have mostly clear skies out toward the west. So here's your weather headlines for today. It's going to be a chilly start, and I think the clouds will linger here for the next several hours, but then clouds will start to give way to some sunshine by this afternoon. That's going to help us get to the upper 40s for the high. So you have a very mild January afternoon on tap for us today. But one thing to note, the wind will really start to increase as the day goes on. So the National Weather Service did put a wind advisory in effect for far north and western Iowa. And Carroll included that up towards Pocahontas. Algona included in that. Fort Dodge not, but it is going to be a quiet of a windy day for you. That begins at 3 p.m. and will go through 9 p.m. this evening with the highest gust potentially up to around 45 miles per hour. So we have a clipper system up to the north that's bringing some clouds in right now. A little bit of light snow into parts of Minnesota. Going to watch this as it sags toward the south. Could get maybe a clipping of that light snow in far eastern Iowa this morning into the early afternoon hours. Here's about 1 o'clock. Notice temperatures already in the mid to upper 40s down south as we start to get some gradual clearing. That's when the wind will really start to increase and will continue through the evening hours. Again, our high going to make it to the upper 40s for today. For tonight, I think skies will stay partly cloudy. If you live around Mason City Points East, there's a slight chance of maybe a little freezing drizzle trying to work in. Maybe a few snowflakes mixed in with that as we still have a little bit of moisture coming in from the from the north and uh, west. Now overnight tonight into tomorrow morning, we will start to see clouds also increasing from south to north. So I think tomorrow is going to be a little bit cooler with more cloud cover. Now here are the winds. Now notice I mentioned this morning is going to be fairly light as we get into the afternoon. That's when we're going to feel the winds really start to increase gust uh, potentially 40 to 40 for you and Algona down towards Carroll, even though this model indicating between about 35 and 40, I still think we could get some higher gusts. Not out of the question here in the metro area to see gusts between 30 to 35, and that will continue in the overnight hours to tomorrow morning. So yeah, if your trash days today, going to be a breezy one. Even tomorrow morning, look at the winds gusting close to around 30 miles per hour. So your statewide forecast for today, lower 40s up north, have you just a little bit cooler due to the fact that you have some uh, a little bit more in the way of snowpack up north, but I think it's going to be very warm here for us in Des Moines 48 to near 52 down in Lamoni. So that eight day forecast some changes on the way. We ha have more cloud cover tomorrow with a cool down through Thursday and Friday. Going to be watching a system over the weekend that could bring us maybe a little light snow coming in Saturday and on Sunday, but drying out by Monday.